days on through the weekend into next week. Not much around the Tennessee Valley, but east of town we did have some really solid rain and still have some pretty good heavy rainfall sliding southward through Benton. And this is really heavy rain, nothing severe, but look at that torrential rain sliding right down toward Camp Ocoee. It's going to be really wet as uh, hopefully there are no campers that are about to experience that outdoors, but I'll bet there are. It's summertime in Camp Ocoee. Come on. Also, Varnell, you've got a nice little spot of heavy rain that's beginning to work its way into your area. Also, 88 degrees in Chattanooga. It's 82 in Cleveland in the 70s up at the Blue Ridge. 86 in Calhoun, 82 in Athens. Dew points in the 60s and 70s, so still some muggy air. And still over the next seven days, we'll see about 2 to 3 inches of rain widespread. 3 to 5 inches of rain up toward the Blue Ridge Mountains. So I do think we'll get it, but we may have to wait. The positioning of this boundary is pretty much going to be the focal point of where the thunderstorms develop today. Unfortunately, for the folks that didn't get any rain, the boundary set up just to the east. I do think we may see one or two more spotty showers as we move through the night tonight and then overnight that front. We're going to start to see it lifting northward just a little bit. Now tomorrow morning in some of our southern communities, we may even get a couple of showers for tomorrow morning. Tomorrow afternoon, some spotty showers and thunderstorms begin to fire up and then as that front begins to work its way northward a little bit about five o'clock scattered showers and thunderstorms heavy rain down to the south toward Atlanta, but we'll have some good coverage of scattered showers and storms as well, and then that will last into our Friday evening by Saturday, uh, Saturday morning through Saturday afternoon. We'll put the chance of showers and storms not that high at about 40% and then moving into Saturday night. Still a few of those Sunday we will bump it up to a 50% chance of showers and storms as that low continues to hang around and then even into Monday and Tuesday we will have more scattered showers and scattered thunderstorms. We could see some of these uh, during the morning or during the afternoon or during the night. That's going to be the case basically all week long. So about a 40 to 50% chance of showers and storms through the weekend and into next week. So 70 for the low tonight. Spotty storms fading after sunset. We're starting to see that happening right now. 70 degrees overnight in Chattanooga, 67 in Cleveland, 68 in Dalton. And then tomorrow we're going to heat it up to 86. That's it. A few AM showers again south of Chattanooga primarily. And then we'll have mainly late in the afternoon storms lingering into our Friday night as we head into our weekend. And you're going to have sporadic showers and storms on and off through the weekend. Just have the umbrella, have the indoor alternative plan. If you do have outdoor plans, it is going to be in the low to mid 80s, even the upper 70s for highs in some of the higher elevations. So there we go. Storm alert seven day forecast 60% chance of showers and storms. The highest chance will be late in the afternoon into your Friday night and then a few sporadic showers and storms on and off Saturday. I think we'll have long periods of time where we have no rain on Saturday, but again, just be ready and then we'll increase the coverage a little bit on Sunday. 40 to 50% chance of showers and storms. Highs staying in the mid to upper 80s through next.